Yellow Rhythmic Human Day 6 of the wave that we are in. And the sixth day and the sixth point of a wave is the balance point. Forgive me, I still am coughing a bit. It's the balance point because it's sort of the mid part of the wave. The wave is 13 days long, but it's the balance part because it is speaking to the number six and the number six is speaking to the sacred geometry of the Merkaba, the star tetrahedron, which is the alchemical symbol for divine union between fire and water, the masculine and the feminine. So bringing those into balance so that they can come together is what this is about. This energy of the rhythmic energy. It's about bringing the balance to the masculine and the feminine energy, the yin and the yang within. And human obviously represents us humanity and the journey of humanity and its journey of evolution. And so the sixth point, this point in the wave is critical in the wave. So we've been in this yang, yin, up and down dance and so now we have to bring that into balance. We have to really be balanced otherwise we're not going to make the rest of the journey. Um, and, and the sixth point on a wave um, is always in the same kin as the wave is. So blue hand and yellow human have a relationship with each other. They are actually the supporting energy of each other. So you know, what really supports us is our ability to get things done and do things and to in, uh, design things and make things. And we have this ability to, to transform reality other, you know, compared to other beings and species that are on this planet, we have this ability. And we've been really busy exploring the, uh, the outer limits of that um, ability. But we have done too much because we don't know how to balance within ourselves. So we're like overly addicted to the yang aspect, so we're doing. And we haven't cultivated the yin aspect, which is non-doing. Nature shows us that there has to be balance. So if we're out of balance, then it's going to create problems. And we've been far too busy, busy actually doing what? Because we haven't really known what we're doing. We've like created a whole other construct that is divorced from nature, separated from the rhythm of natural time that would align us with the divine plan so that we could get on with what we came to do. And so it's like spinning its wheels, but it's coming to a crescendo and the rebalancing of humanity is what is being called for right now. And it's interesting to feel that energy of this day, very different to yesterday, I was feeling the wounded child aspect, and I'm feeling better today, I've still got this cough, but balanced in myself a little more, and able to really connect with the energy of what it would be like, what it would be like, when, when we are in a more balanced place as a humanity, like we're balanced in our masculine and feminine within, we're able to be balanced with each other, we can create from this inner peace that balance brings. So we have to be balanced on all levels of our being, mentally, emotionally, energetically, and health-wise. I mean, we're having to face all of this imbalance, how we stepped away from our true nature, we've stepped away from our organic nature, and we are being too busy correcting what was already perfect in nature, uh, instead of learning how to be one with her and evolve organically, we have violated some of those natural laws, and so there's a reset going on because we need, because we need to heal and we need to know the truth of who we are and we have to go on that journey of healing in order to know and step into our knowledge, our real knowledge, out of the lies and the illusion of this reality that has separated us, separated us from the truth and, and that is reflected in the separation that we're experiencing in this reality. So it is a wonderful time of healing even though it is necessary to heal, sometimes we need to have something come up so that we can heal it. And um, we are in this.
this lunar storm and things will be coming up and knowledge will be reclaimed and understanding will be reclaimed and healing will happen and then we will know what is next, what is coming for us to do. Whereas now we may not know what is we may not know what is happening. But what we can do is focus on the message of today, which is to bring ourselves into balance, to bring humanity into balance by doing the inner work within ourselves. And we each have the ability to influence each other by being rather than trying to communicate what we think we know without having embodied that. We don't really know. We can only embody this balance and reflect that balance. So that is the message of the day. Bring into balance your own human and bring your human into balance with doing and non-doing and just be an open vessel of spirit and soon you will know what you need to know.